welcome to just vibey vibes welcome let's talk about love island usa episode one and two okay for me the first thing was i like the new host she gives me friendship vibes i like her. i like ian sterling actually doing the voiceover i did like the voiceover person from last season i'm not gonna lie but in standard is is quite cool. I think it's a good thing. But I'm like, how does he even have the time to do both? More money for him. But I do like the new host. She gives me like she cares vibe. You know, for a while we need someone that gives us the you know, I don't want to Caroline vibe, you know. Someone that actually does care. Not just someone that's just there to do the strength and all of that, but someone that cares. She gives me the friendship vibes and I like it. Because you need someone that feels like they are part of the villa people's family you know i mean part of the villa not just someone that comes to the villa from time to time even if they do come to the villa from time to time we need that so i like that about them when all the girls came in i liked all the girls actually then when the guys came in the people that were giving me hmm Isaiah, i just felt like he was giving me kind of like player vibe giving me the guy to just have fun with but not take home to your parents and uh timmy i liked andy i was just out of that oop uh, oop oop i'm like if i hear one more oop again one more just try it one more time because enough of the oop is enough anyway so then um jesse i don't know philippe i don't know so the guys most of them had question mark question mark question mark the only guy i actually liked was timmy and then when it comes to the coupling which was andy and courtney uh obviously we could see that andy like courtney courtney was not that much into uh into andy like that and then zeta and timmy were was now also the only couple that actually liked because they had this vibe they had chemistry between them you can see that clearly and then as i am sydney close to the end when the guys were supposed to pick who was going to go on the date he clearly said he liked her and all the guys could clearly see that he really liked her so i was like huh and she was talking to the girls and she really liked him so i was like okay this could be another strong couple so i'm looking at okay zeta and timmy and Isaiah and sydney could be the people you know what i mean that the couple that kind of make it to the end when it comes to felipe and serenity i don't know if like he said brunette is his type obviously she's brunette but i don't know does he mean like is it like any kind of any brunette or is just is white brunette or anybody that has brunette hair because i don't know when i don't understand when hair is someone's type just makes no sense to me someone say hair is their type i don't know that's something like blonde is my type brunette is my type blonde blue eyes according to andy but then you're with someone else that was not blonde and blue eyes and you were so much into her she was the one that wasn't even into you now all of a sudden like i would not lie this episode two took me for a loop i did not expect the guys to just like all the guys every one of them like there was none of them like i didn't see timmy do like you know trying to talk to a girl like actually showing interest i didn't see isaiah now isaiah is giving me uh, abusive vibes like saying oh red flags like and he's telling her about her red flags you just met the girl how many seconds ago you're already telling her about red flags god please if i am her i'll be praying that valerie is it valerie actually couples up with Isaiah because at this stage girl sydney you do not need someone that starts telling about red flag and if someone does not talk about red flag then that's a red flag for someone that does not see red flags wow 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 like where did they pick him anyway he's 21 years old what did they pick if <sighs> Where did they get these guys from? Because most of the guys were actually 27, 29. And I was like, okay, this is a mature set. I was even saying that, ah, you know what I mean? That this is, you know, more matured and uh, contestant in there. Or islanders in there. But wow. The 21-year-old is telling the, the girl about red flags. Like, you just met someone. Like, you're already seeing red flags. Then well, why, do you, why would you even want to be with the person anyway? And then the other guy's like, oh, you're my type. I can't see any red flags. Oh, you're just 100 percent my type and he's like yeah if i see i will tell you girl if you choose him your dummy just come like dumb dumps like literally you need slap to reset your brain if someone talks like that about <laughs> let me tell you when you're talking to someone they talk about their ex you listen 
those people that the ex just did wrong 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 they never did any wrong in the relationship those people run away from them because it doesn't matter what someone does you can like you need someone that can be able to say where okay like even if the ex was doing wrong their own wrong could be okay i stayed for too long or i put up, up with it for too long all the day someone that is someone that knows where they're going wrong at someone that can check themselves is very important because in life most people they will tell you oh there is that when you get to date them you see everything and you'll be like wow so they were the ones you know what i mean so uh-uh this guy Isaiah guy just was just giving me honestly i don't know a uh, man the company up with andy i think that was a good thing she's family oriented he's family oriented the moment she, she she said family oriented, i just knew he was the one and the girl he was with which was courtney i think was not into him so it was a good thing that he coupled up with uh, but then I don't know who Valerie is going to couple up with. She might think she's doing something sweet right now. But those guys are not to be trusted. Like each and every one of them. I do understand that they just got there. And I think that Serenity, you need to kind of let it be. Like just calm down. Like pipe, pipe down. Calm down a bit. Like you just met this guy. Like I, I don't see Philippe going with you to the finals. I do not see Philippe staying with Serenity to the final. I don't see that. So I don't know why she sees that. He said he does, he's not seeing romantic vibes. You know what I mean? Like, uh -uh, I don't see that at all, at all. But it is what it is. Let's see what uh, tomorrow's episode is going to bring because I am in shock. I didn't expect this. I like the challenge, but I felt like the guys were just kissing who they wanted to kiss. And and the girls even maybe put a little bit of effort, but for some reason, the guys still won. And, um, yeah, honestly. Yeah, yesterday I did enjoy the challenge of the dance and the this and the that. Everything, everything that was done. I don't know. This is just. I know that they are going to bring. Um, obviously, they're not just going to send two people home. They're going to bring. Um, a bombshell. One bombshell. Male will come in. Then one girl will go home. So we'll see who who is going home. I do like most of the girls. Honestly, I like the original five girls. I like the way they hyped each other up. Like from Deb, Deb and Serenity, they, they had that this thing first. Like any girl that came in, they hyped them up, made everybody feel uh, beautiful. You know, the way they, it was just so sweet. So I, I don't know. We'll see what happens, honestly. Like the whole thing, it just, I, like these boys, they just, I, I, I am in shock at how everyone's head turned today. Like the girls were not even giving that much though. Like they were not giving, it was just like, I don't get it. And they, they, the guys were literally grafting as if this was like an NBA pick. Like, and they want to be pick number one. Seriously, you're not in danger. Why are you grafting so hard? Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye!